Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. Today we will be talking about the newly launched Redmi Buds 5. So this is a new uh, TWS announced by Redmi in India for a price of around 2 triple nine. that's 3000 rupees and you get plenty of features including active noise cancellation, 12.4 mm uh, drivers, then you get fast pairing, then you get fast charging as well and then apart from that dual device pairing is there. So plenty of features including app support is there. So let's talk about how good the experience is and what is my impression about this device. Uh, should you buy the Redmi Buds? That's what we are going to talk about in this video. So before getting into the video, if this is your first time on this channel do hit that red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin so this is the redmi uh, buds 5 so again uh, redmi has been launching budget earphones uh, for quite some time there has been uh, earphones in the xiaomi branding as well as the redmi branding redmi has been more budget friendly so this is 299 and let's go uh, first uh, have a look at how good uh, the uh, build quality fit and finish is what, what all features it offers so this is the box packaging i can see the image of the redmi buds 5 and some of the important features are mentioned here up to 46 decibels uh, hybrid active noise cancellation and uh, we get 12.4 mm dynamic titanium drivers up to 38 hours playback AI enhancement for calls dual device pairing and fast charging is also supported 10 minutes of charging will give you 4 hours of music playback and you can see here Google's fast pair support is there so inside the box you get additional pair the charging cable and the TWS so let's go straight into the TWS so this is the Redmi TWS and you can see the color looks pretty good it's a fusion purple color from the redmi note uh, 13 series and you can see here uh, the colors are very mild and which looks pretty good the redmi branding is written here in bold and uh, here we have the uh, uh, the details mentioned and here we have the usb type c port and there is a groove to open when you open you can see the dual coloring very similar to the redmi uh, note 13 pro plus 5g and you can see here this place is glossy here you get a matte finish sides are also glossy and here this is glossy and there is also also battery indicator here you can see it's a pretty large battery indicator here as well so when you open it you can see this battery indicator now taking the earphones out uh, you can see there is glossy finishing so this is the TWS and looks pretty good it's very compact earphones and you can see here the charging port here uh, the microphones at the bottom and the top and uh, looks pretty good and uh, you can see you can change the buds here as well so that is also good here you can see uh, a kind of chrome finishing which also acts as the gestures area uh, which looks pretty good as well so overall the build quality looks good although the plastic material on this case looks uh, slightly kind of a budget one but still uh, for a 2999 uh, variant this is definitely good in terms of build quality these edges are a bit sharper but overall i wouldn't mind that because this is more of a budget earphone not a premium one so overall build quality fit and finish and colors are pretty good actually uh, the colors especially this purple color looks very good uh, mild colors and uh, with the combination of green and purple actually feels very nice and uh, the earphones are purple in color so that's the design aspect now next uh, let's talk about the features now you actually get 12.4 um, uh, mm uh, uh, dynamic driver on this and uh, with the titanium diaphragm uh, it has two microphones per earphones uh, SBC and AAC are the codec supported now noise cancellation ANC supported is hybrid 46 decibels three modes are there transparency noise cancellation and uh, you can turn it off ENC is there for call reductions and anti wind noise algorithm is also there apart from that connectivity bluetooth 5.3 support 10 meters is uh, the support and uh, google's fast pair support is also there for these earphones now other features include ip54 dust and splash proof and the touch uh, gesture controls are also there and voice active activated uh, uh, you can also activate uh, voice assistant on these earphones so let's just take these earphones so you can see here these are pretty good in terms of uh, fit and finish and build quality so in terms of comfort let me just wear you and show you uh, so I am just wearing uh, the Redmi Buds 5 and overall I feel comfort level is good and uh, you can uh, since it has uh, removable uh, ear tips you can actually change them to your liking so uh, in my usage uh, I felt that these are pretty good comfortable uh, fit and finish and it doesn't fall off even during workout it does give a good seal actually uh, apart from active noise cancellation the good thing about this earphone is that uh, at least for my ears the uh, the ear canal has a good uh, um, cancel 
noise cancellation that means there is also passive noise cancellation that makes it uh, good actually it will reduce the external noise to an extent using passive noise cancellation as well along with that you also get active noise cancellation we'll talk about that in a while so overall build quality fit and finish looks good and the comfort levels are also quite acceptable next let's talk about the call quality now we have accepted a few calls using this and we didn't have any issues as such uh, we talked for like five ten minutes uh, each call and uh, absolutely no issues uh, in terms of the mic uh, uh, it was crystal clear for the person and i could hear the voice from the caller also without any sort of issue so call quality in our uh, testing uh, we didn't face any issues next let's talk about the sound quality now sound quality depend upon person to person some person like uh, a kind of uh, more uh, balanced sound signature some like uh, a bit more bass uh, signature some like uh, a bit more of treble so in this earphones uh, the default signature is kind of slightly balanced i would say not a base uh, uh, centric earphones but again you can customize using the app we'll just show you the app as well so overall i would say the sound signature is quite good i would say for this price segment in my usage i like the sound signature it's quite good uh, again it's not a bass heavy but you can control uh, you, uh, the bass uh, and uh, when you increase the bass what i felt was the bass quality could have been tad better uh, it's not as good as some of the 4k and 5k uh, price earphones of course they are priced higher but uh, this the base quality could have been a tad better i would say but otherwise the sound signature looks good uh, for the 3000 price segment it is being offered and there is also good sound separation uh, which uh, makes the vocals also pretty good uh, and uh, uh, the instrument separation also is good so overall i would say for 3000 rupees these are pretty good in terms of sound experience and that's what uh, i feel uh, uh, using the redmi buds 5 now the active noise cancellation it's uh, uh, it's kind of okay i would say it uh, does filter out uh, some noises uh, inside the room especially if you are in office uh, the noise of ac the pc running all these noises can filter around 46 decibels uh, hybrid active noise cancellation is there but when you move out uh, the obviously uh, with uh, heavy noises it may not be able to work that great but inside the office the noise cancellation is quite decent and there are three modes available transparency noise cancellation and you can turn it off as well now in terms of battery life uh, we felt that the battery life is good up to 38 hours is promised again if you turn on the active noise cancellation it will obviously reduce and this is again with a 50 50 to 60 percentage volume if you crank up the volume to 100 percentage probably you may not get that battery life but overall i would say the battery life is quite acceptable for this price segment now next let's uh, talk about the app uh, which is available for this device so you can download uh, the xiaomi uh, earbuds app and you can see now i've connected you can see the noise cancellation transparency of there is also balanced uh, and and you can go with the light or uh, you can go with the deep then uh, you get the gestures control i can see a tap on the left earphone once uh, double tap triple tap all these things you can see press and hold the earphones for transparency or off uh, then a triple tap you can see you can there is also volume control if you want to increase or decrease the volume you can also do that so gestures are pretty good actually on this then uh, additional uh, settings uh, you get uh, audio uh, you can see here enhanced treble uh, enhanced bass and enhanced voice so you can actually adjust uh, uh, the sound quality quality so in the additional settings you can see there is in-ear detection pause the audio when the earphones are taken out then you can go with uh, the ear tip uh, fit test there is dual connection that means you can connect to two devices at the same time then take call automatically incoming calls uh, if you are using the earphones will be automatically answered these are some features which are not available in this price segment that's make that makes uh, the redmi buds 5 uh, pretty good in terms of features that is being offered then uh, you can go with uh, uh, updating uh, earphones you can also find the earphones tap to play the left uh, tap to play the right both you can uh, find out in case you have misplaced it so these are the options available you can see your noise cancellation you can turn it off as well so these are the options available uh, in uh, uh, the earphone so overall i feel uh, the app support is pretty good uh, pretty solid support uh, with uh, these earphones and they look good as well you can see the uh, fit and finish and uh, the overall quality definitely looks good so that was my experience with the redmi buds 5 so overall at the price of 2 triple and we feel this is good value uh, product uh, uh, it is loaded with features uh, good uh, 
uh, audio quality in fact uh, the it's kind of balanced sound signature again if you want bass so you can uh, customize it uh, using the uh, app support then there is active noise cancellation which works quite well then there is a good battery life again uh, the app support is really good there are tons of features available uh, the fast charging is there fast pairing is there everything is there uh, in this earphone including in-ear detection so that makes it really great value for money at that 2999 pricing so you can buy it from the redmi uh, website for this uh, 2999 pricing so that was my experience with the redmi buds 5 hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day